I bet you didn't know this. Well, Dr. Malcolm, here to share a few campfire stories with my uncle. I was there, I know what happened, and so do you. In Jem, is my responsibility now, Doctor, and I will jealously defend its interests. Oh. You were right and I was wrong there. Did you ever expect to hear me say such a thing? Isla Nobla was just a showroom, something for the tourists. Site B was the factory floor. That was on Ina Sauna. A few weeks ago, a British family on a yacht cruise stumbled across the island. The boarders used the incident to take control of Injun from me. Okay, so there's another island with dinosaurs, no fences this time, and you want to send people in? I need a complete photo record of those animals. You didn't contact Sarah. She'll be fine. And believe me, the research team was not a research expedition anymore. It's a rescue operation, and it's leaving right now. You can't shave three days off my deadline. Expect everything to be ready. I'm not fully supplied. I never feel tested any of this stuff. All right, people, we're going nowhere until we get these vehicles fixed up. stuck in there. I can't see anything. What do you guys have that <sighs> engine starter thing? Ah, yeah, that's it. Oh, uh, these vehicles, gas or cheese, anyone see what he's going to get? Can't get this jar of peanut butter open. Please explain to me again why you can't get the tires down, Carl. The shelf's really high. I'll get a nosebleed. Can someone please get that tire? I can't. I'm technically management. I can't get the engine bits to stay in. Can y'all give it a try? So. Uh, think you could take a look at those, uh, uh brown parts for me? Oh, man. Either you fix the car or the boss fixes me. Give a guy a hand. I have a bit of advice that might help. Just dried paint. <sighs> it's never too late to learn something new.
I, I need half air on the tires here, guys. All right. So, you think you're too attached to me, Taro? Yeah. I'm not completely useless. From rubber? <sighs> Just get in the car. I used a mallet, so yeah, explains it. <laughs> hey, hey, please burn like a kitten. A really, really loud kitten. <laughs> oh, thanks. Now, 
green. It's meant to be green. The idea is that the dinosaurs can't see us. Or do you want to be eaten by a T-Rex? But it wasn't me. No fair. Aww. And I'm not gonna look down you again, stupid nozzle. said it's meant to be green. Are you not familiar with colors? Did you never sing a rainbow as a child? That's the one about the incy wincy spider, right? This is Ian Malcolm. Nick's our field photographer. Ian is our... Ian. Oh, just a second. Uh, I know I've got the key somewhere. Is that it? No, that's a candy bar. Ooh, what's that? Uh, another candy bar. And well, that's yet another candy bar. I think I might have a problem with candy bars. Yeah, I do. <laughs> there should be at least another two in there. Mr. DNA, at your service. You'll have to fix it later. Mm -hmm. Whew. 
It's no use. That engine ain't budging. You got any idea how to push that in without pulling a hamstring? Oh, man. I never should have taken home the engine hoist to shift my couch. Safety? Sheesh! Whoa! I never would have thought to do that! Okay, okay. 
Okay, stop. She's home. Thanks. This is a high, high hide. You know, you go up and you hide. Hi. Actually, it's part of a very convenient fighting thing. Someone meant to be putting a roof on the mobile lab? Or is it meant to be an open top? You know, it might rain on the island. At the very least, we should consider making it a convertible. the location sensor into Dr. Hardy's satellite pump, so we should be getting a reading. Mr. DNA, at your service. Oh. 